Hi, this is Sherry Veronica. I think that this article is important. I think that even though you may not have symptoms or you may think you don't have symptoms of depression or anxiety, you probably do, especially if you're in a relationship. If you are in a relationship, you probably are shrinking yourself in some way you're probably in denial in certain things you are probably overlooking a whole lot of things that you should be looking at just to maintain the peace or just to maintain the relationship just not to focus on the trap that you're in because a lot of people in relationships are trapped you're totally trapped so if there's any time that this particular article should be looked at carefully. It should be people who are in relationships. That's what I think. And I also feel as though I should say that opposites, when, we, when people tell you that opposites attract, there's a price for that. There's a price for you trying to fool your brain there's always a price to be paid because for instance i had a a battery that was dying it wasn't my lawnmower wasn't turning and i had to put you know you have to get that that automatic thing that stuff that you buy from the store to charge it and if you put the red on the black and the black on the if you do some kind of messed up shit like that you need to put the black on the black and the red on the red opposites opposites do not attract so again i say to you you're fooling your brain and if you are in a relationship if you are in a because this is for middle age young and middle age adults if you are in a relationship you must look at this article it is on apple news i don't know if you subscribe to that but it's something that is worth reading Sure, Veronica.